Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you all? I hope you are all fine and enjoying life well. In today's video, we are diving into world of cross stitch. Whether you are complete beginners or looking to fresh your skill, this video is for you. Let's get started. Let's gather everything you need to get started with cross stitch. Fabric, floss, needle, hoop or frame, scissor, a pattern or chart. First of all, we will choose the right fabric for your project such as either cloth or even wave. Explore different type of floss including cotton, pearl and metallic. Select the appropriate needle size for your fabric and floss. A hoop or frame help keep your fabric taut. Scissor for cutting fabric and floss. Pattern or chart this will guide your stitching. The cross stitch demonstrate how to complete a project, how to make a complete cross stitch, explaining the over two and under two passes. Back stitch show how to use back stitch for outlining and adding detail. Centering your fabric show how to find the center of your fabric and pattern to ensure even stitching. You can also buy many frames etc according to your size according to the fabric size if you want to do some small cross stitch ideas for example you just want to paste the cross stitch on the front of your baby's cloth then you can buy small frame or if you want to do some big project then you can buy big frame i am also going to share the basic detail of cross stitch with you Cross stitch is a full form of sewing and a popular form of counted thread. Embroidery in which X shaped stitches is styled. Rister like patterns are used to form a picture. The stitcher counts a thread on a piece of even weave fabric such as linen in each direction so that the stitches are of uniform size and appearance. This form of cross stitch is also called counted cross stitch in order to distinguish it from other form of cross stitch. Sometimes cross stitch is done on design printed on the fabric. The stitcher simply stitches over the printed pattern. Cross stitch is often executed on easily counted fabric called either cloth. Whose weave create a plainly visible grid of squares with hole for the needle at each corner. Fabric used in cross stitch include linen, either cloth and miscontent fabric called even weave such as jobilan all cross stitch fabric are technically even weave as the term refer to the fact that the fabric is woven to make sure that there are the same number of thread per inch in both the warp and weft fabric are categorized by threads per inch which can range from 11 to 40 count counted cross stitch project are work from a gridded pattern color chart and can be used on any count fabric the count of the fabric and the number of the thread per stitch determine the size of the finished stitching. For example, if a given design is stitched on a 28 count cross stitch fabric with each cross worked over two thread, the finished stitching size is the same as it will be on 14 count at the fabric with each cross worked over one square. These methods are referred to as 2 over 2 which means two embroidery thread used to stitch over two fabric thread and one over one which means one embroidery thread used to stitch over one fabric thread or square respectively. There are different methods of stitching a pattern including the cross country method where one color is stitched at a time or the parking method where one block of fabric is stitched at a time and the end of the thread is parked at the next point the same color occur in pattern. Cross stitch can be found all over the world since the middle age. Many folk museums show example of cloth decorated with cross stitch, especially for continental Europe and Asia. The cross stitch sampler is called that because cross stitch is very easy to do. Viewers, if you want more information about cross stitch or ideas about cross stitch, then viewers, please leave the comment below. I will upload more designing ideas for you on my YouTube channel for you. Not only flower, floral design or border design, but all the designing ideas that you want on my YouTube channel. For example, if you want cushion cover, it is also available on my YouTube 
and if you want many more designing ideas every type of design is available on my youtube viewers you can also do some color contrasting if you see these type of designing ideas and you don't like the color then viewers you can also swatch the color according to your color palette according to your favorite color suggest a beginner friendly projects like bookmark coasters ornament i suggested you these type of designing ideas beginner friendly because they are very beginner friendly and you can easily do that and viewers if you want to frame the designing ideas or if you want to do some more ideas like that then viewers you can also do it by apply pva glue on the back of cross stitch apply pva glue on the back of cross stitch by cutting the fabric and also viewers apply it in the frame or just frame it from the market or just buy some photo frame and deattach the photo and place the cross stitch cross stitch in embroidery needle point in another form of needle work include a number of related stitches in which the thread is sewn in an x or plus shape cross stitch has been called probably the most widely used stitch of all time and is part of the needle work tradition of the balkans middle east afghanistan colonial america and victorian england cross stitches was typically of 16th century canvas work falling out of fashion in favor of tent stitch toward the center of the century canvas work in cross stitch become popular again in the mid 19th century with the berlin wool work craze herring bone fish bone van dyck and related cross stitches are using creole embroidery especially to add texture to stems leaves and similar objects basic cross stitch is used to fill background and sec work cross stitch was wisely used to mark household linen in the 18th and 19th centuries and girl skills in this essential task were demonstrated with elaborate samplers embroidered with cross stitch alphabet numbers birds and other animals and the crown and coronets sewn into the linen of the nobility much of contemporary cross stitch embroidery derived from this tradition common variant of cross stitch include basic cross stitch long arm cross stitch double cross stitch italian basket leaf herring bone close herring bone tagged herring bone threaded herring bone and tied herring bone stitch montagnard stitch trellis stitch thorn stitch van dyck stitch the most famous are italian cross embroidery long arm cross embroidery and black mountain embroidery i hope viewers you gain some information from this video or if you want more info about any type of cross stitch idea then just leave the comment okay take care